Welcome to our latest video on the top 10 dangerous dog breeds for families with kids. If you're thinking about getting a furry companion for your little ones, it's important to do your research and make sure that the breed is suitable for your family. While any dog has the potential to be dangerous if they are not properly trained and socialized, some breeds are more prone to aggression or have physical characteristics that make them more of a risk for families with kids. In this video, we'll be counting down the top 10 dog breeds that are not recommended for families with young children. But before we get started, let's take a moment to talk about why this topic is so important. As a parent or guardian, it's your responsibility to ensure the safety of your kids. This includes choosing a pet that is appropriate for your family dynamic and lifestyle. While it's true that any dog has the potential to be dangerous if they are not properly trained and socialized, some breeds are known to be more aggressive or have physical characteristics that make them more of a risk for families with kids. For example, a large breed with a strong prey drive may be more prone to attacking small animals or children, or a breed with a history of being used in dog fights may have a higher risk of aggression towards humans. On the other hand, some breeds are more docile and gentle, and may be better suited for families with kids. It's important to do your research and make an informed decision before bringing any pet into your home. In this video, we'll be counting down the top 10 dog breeds that are not recommended for families with young children. We'll discuss the breed's characteristics, their potential for aggression, and their intelligence level according to the intelligence of dogs rating. So, without further ado, let's get started on our countdown of the top 10 dangerous dog breeds for families with kids. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos. At number 10 on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids, we have the Rottweiler. These dogs are known for their strength, protectiveness, and intelligence, but they also require a lot of training and socialization to prevent them from becoming aggressive. It is essential to properly train and socialize any dog, but it is especially important for breeds like the Rottweiler, which have a strong desire to protect and defend their families. However, with the right training and socialization, Rottweilers can be loyal and loving pets for families with children. According to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, Rottweilers are ranked 8th out of 138 breeds, indicating their ability to learn commands and be obedient. It is important to remember that every dog is an individual, and even with proper training and socialization, there is still the potential for any dog to exhibit aggressive behavior. It is crucial to carefully consider the breed and individual dog before bringing them into a family with kids. Number 9 on our list is the Basenji, a breed of dog also known as the African Barkless Dog. These dogs may not have the same strong odor or loud barking as other breeds, but they are known for their extreme curiosity and intelligence. This can lead to destructive behavior if not properly trained and socialized. In addition, basingers have been known to be aggressive towards other animals, making them a potentially dangerous breed for families with kids. According to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, the Basenji ranks at number 25 out of 138 breeds. It's important to remember that all dogs, regardless of breed, have the potential to become dangerous if not properly trained and socialized. Therefore, it's crucial to carefully consider the breed and individual dog before bringing them into a home with children. It's also important to continuously train and socialize your dog to ensure they are well behaved and safe around kids. If you have any doubts about whether a certain breed is suitable for your family, it's always best to consult with a professional or do thorough research before making a decision. Number 8 on our list is the Mastiff. This breed of dog is known for its massive size and immense strength, 
which can make them a potential danger to young children. It's important to be aware that their size alone can make them capable of accidentally knocking over or causing harm to a child with their playful nature. In addition to their size, it's crucial to also consider the fact that mastiffs require a lot of training and socialization in order to prevent them from becoming aggressive. Without proper care and attention, they may exhibit aggressive behavior towards others, including children. It's worth noting that according to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, Mastiffs rank 123 out of 138 in terms of their ability to learn commands and be obedient. So, if you're considering adding a Mastiff to your family, it's crucial to take the time to properly train and socialize them in order to ensure the safety of everyone, especially young children. Number 7 on our list is the Russian toy dog. These tiny pooches may seem like the perfect companion due to their gentle and loyal nature. However, it's important to keep in mind that they have a truly sensitive nature and can easily become stressed when around active children. In fact, they may even become timid and fearful as a result of this stress. It's important to consider whether or not this breed is the right fit for your family especially if you have little ones running around. In addition to their sensitive nature, Russian toy dogs are also well known for their fragility. It's essential to handle them with care and avoid squeezing or dropping them, even from small heights. This breed is generally recommended for single people or families with grown-up kids rather than families with young children. It's important to carefully consider all aspects of this breed before deciding to bring one into your family. Number 6 on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids is the Dalmatian. These dogs may be well known thanks to the movie 101 Dalmatians, but they are not to be underestimated. They can be quite large, with strong muscles and high levels of energy. If not properly trained and socialized, they can become a bit of a loose cannon and cause problems in a family setting. It's important to remember that these dogs require serious training in order to prevent any potential issues from arising. And according to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, they are ranked 60 to end out of 138 breeds. So it's important to be aware of their potential for disobedience if you're considering adopting one. It's not to say that Dalmatians are inherently dangerous, but it's crucial to be diligent in their training and to constantly monitor their interactions with children to ensure their safety. It's also worth noting that these dogs are quite active and require plenty of exercise and mental stimulation to keep them happy and healthy. With the right amount of care and attention, a Dalmatian can make a great companion for a family but it's important to be aware of their needs and to be prepared to put in the necessary time and effort to ensure a smooth and harmonious relationship. Number 5 on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids is the pit bull. These dogs have gained a negative reputation over the years due to their use in dog fighting. However, it's important to remember that any dog has the potential to be dangerous if they are not properly trained and socialized. Pit bulls are no exception to this rule. They can be loving and loyal pets, but they do require a lot of training and socialization to prevent them from becoming aggressive. It's important to remember that they are ranked 70th on the Intelligence of Dogs rating, which reflects how easily they can learn commands and how obedient they are. This ranking should be taken into consideration when deciding if a pit bull is the right fit for your family. Remember, any breed has the potential to be dangerous if not properly cared for and trained. It's important to do your research and choose a breed that is a good fit for your family and lifestyle. Number 4 on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids is the Akita Anu. These fluffy and adorable dogs may seem like the perfect companion for your child, but they can actually be quite challenging to have in your household. For one, they are known to be suspicious of strangers and may not take kindly to children they are not familiar with. Additionally, 
Echidna and new dogs have a tendency to be aggressive towards other animals, particularly those of their own breed. This means that they can suddenly attack other dogs, regardless of their size. According to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, the Akita Anu ranks 104th out of 138 in terms of obedience and ease of learning commands. It's important to keep this in mind if you are considering adopting an Akita Anu into your family with kids. It may take some extra training and socialization to ensure that they are well behaved and won't pose a threat to your little ones. But with the right guidance and patience, these cute and fluffy dogs can make great companions for families with kids. Just be sure to keep a close eye on their interactions and be prepared to provide plenty of structure and discipline. Number 3 on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids is the Husky. These dogs may be known for their beautiful and fluffy coat, but they also have a lot of energy and can be quite mischievous. It's important to remember that they are still dogs and can accidentally hurt or scare young children with their playfulness. They require a lot of attention and exercise. So if you have young kids in your family, you'll want to make sure you have the time and energy to devote to your husky. It's also important to note that huskies rank 70th on the intelligence of dogs rating which means they may require more training and obedience work in order to fully understand and follow commands. When considering adding a husky to your family, it's important to be prepared for the level of care and attention they require and to make sure they are properly trained and socialized in order to prevent any accidental injuries or misunderstandings with your children. Number two on our list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids is the Chow Chow. While they may appear cute and fluffy at first glance, it's important to recognize that these dogs are also known for their independence and can sometimes display aggression towards strangers and other animals. This is why it's crucial to provide these dogs with a significant amount of training and socialization in order to ensure they are well behaved and safe to be around children. It's also worth noting that according to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, Chow are ranked 112 out of 138 breeds. This ranking reflects the ease with which these dogs can learn commands and their level of obedience. It's essential to keep this in mind when considering whether or not a Chow Chow is the right fit for your family and your specific situation. As with any dog, it's important to carefully research the breed and understand their unique characteristics and needs before bringing them into your home. It's also essential to provide consistent training and socialization to ensure that your dog is well behaved and safe to be around children. Remember, any dog has the potential to be dangerous if they are not properly trained and socialized. So it's essential to be proactive and take the necessary steps to ensure the safety of your family. Finally, at the top of our list, we have the Doberman as the most dangerous dog breed for families with kids. These dogs are known for their hunting skills and obedience, but they also have a tendency to want to dominate. It's important to provide them with extensive training to ensure they understand that kids are their masters and not the other way around. It's also crucial to be careful when choosing a Doberman as a pet, as this breed has unfortunately been subjected to irresponsible breeding practices in the past. According to the Intelligence of Dogs rating, Dobermans are ranked 5th in terms of their ability to learn commands and obey orders. But why are Dobermans considered dangerous for families with children? Well, it's not because they are inherently aggressive or vicious, but rather because of their size and strength. These dogs can weigh upwards of 100 pounds and have powerful muscles. So it's essential to teach them to control their strength and be gentle when interacting with kids. It's also essential to socialize Dobermans from a young age to prevent them from becoming aggressive towards unfamiliar people or animals. But don't let this deter you from considering a Doberman as a pet if you have kids. 
with proper training and socialization, Dobermans can be loving and loyal companions for the whole family. They have a natural instinct to protect their pack and can make excellent guard dogs. Just be sure to do your research and choose a reputable breeder or rescue organization. And invest in training and socialization to ensure that your Doberman is a well-behaved and safe companion for your family. Thank you for watching our top 10 list of dangerous dog breeds for families with kids. We hope you found this information useful and will think twice before bringing a new furry friend into your family. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell to stay updated on our latest videos. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to check out our playlist of top videos to learn more about your favorite pets. We value your feedback, so please leave a comment and let us know what you think. We appreciate your support and look forward to bringing you more informative and entertaining content. Thanks again for watching, and have a great day.